Both teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Tremendous stop by Pittler. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time? You want to take space? Goaltender does it. Makes the save. Slides the puck across to Everly. Stopped by the goaltender. They're all over the puck here, James. I mean, their opponent, they didn't even have time to breathe. Such a stick handle in his own zone. Florida's gained possession along the boards. Quick feed to Pendenza. Moving into the attacking zone. Center into the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Handles the pass. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Here's the pass. Scores! What a finish on the play. what you call quick transition in a counter strike James as the puck's going one way towards your end and then it winds up going north and guess what you are the recipient of speed off the rush and you find a way to cash in beautiful play from start to finish the Swamp Rabbits get one quickly here and they're up early in the first that's so important when you're the away team that you don't come out flat you get your lines into it right away and they're rewarded with a goal in that first quarter of the period and they take control of the puck here in the neutral zone Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Takes the feet at the back end. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. The Everblades have it behind the net. Takes a shot. Fearless. Totally fearless on the block. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off after the goalie covers up. Florida's looked sharp tonight offensively, but they still trail here early in the first. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Takes the feed. Stopped by the goaltender. A timely save is everything to your team, and this goaltender, he bails his team out. Martin's a solid defender, but he can still throw up points for his club. Cormier's well-respected and a great competitor between the pipes. Those are two players I'm going to watch closely to see if one of them could be a difference maker for their team tonight. Guys, back to you. And that's knocked away. Takes the pass. Takes the return feed. Great feed from the left side. Greenville's got the puck against the half wall. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Cormier. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. The Swamp Rabbits will play it in their own end. Nice zone entry from the middle. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. And now he moves it quickly to Darcy. Great use of the stick at center by Kemp. Florida's got the puck along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Russell. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. And that's poked away by Darcy. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Sends it in on the attack. Scrum ensues along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Stales. Headman pass. That stretch pass was a beauty, James. Passes out front, and that's intercepted. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. The Everblades get a hold of the puck in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Pendenza. Nice pass save. The Everblades get a hold of the puck along the boards. Pendenza's got it in the offensive end. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Receives the pass. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps it at bay. The Everblades have it now. Florida's looking to break out. Here's a shot. Big save. Well, we know he's got a great glove hand, and man, does he ever show it off right there with that stop. 
More than half the period left to play. Greenville's ahead, 1-0. The Swamp Rabbits win the draw. Slides the puck up from the left side. On the attack along the boards. And a stick in the lane to flex that one away. Looks to set up at the point now. And that goes off a player in front. Scooped up along the wall by Everly. Strong defensive effort. Cormier's got the puck and he's going to hang on. Past the midway mark of the frame. one nothing the score. And with the two tied up off the faceoff, a great read to grab possession of the puck. And they'll dump it in. Nice puck check inside the attacking zone. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. And the setters glide towards the dot here as we got a faceoff set to go. Florida's won it, now they'll go on the attack. Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. The Swamp Rabbits cross the line and gain the zone. This one! What a chance, but can't finish! Well, you gotta make good on a chance like this. This is deflating, James. You don't even put it on the net and test the goaltender. That's a huge miss. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Florida's got the puck in the defensive end. Play whistle dead, penalty coming up. Well, this is a critical juncture of the game. You've got the one goal lead, and now you take a penalty. The PK unit has to be the task and kill this off. Florida sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Power plays are a funny thing, especially when you're down by one, James. You have to act as if you are the hunter, and you have to possess that puck and attack. Puck clears the zone. The Everblades are on the attack. And it's a quick pass to Carpenter. Good save by Bittner. A player should never be left alone in this slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. Everly's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. The Swamp Rabbits start with the puck in their own end. And the puck leaves the zone. Moves it to Carpenter. Poked away in the defensive end. Takes a couple of knocks and loses control. And a solid save there as we play on. Great reflexes, another save. Well, he's been under siege. I'm loving his compete level. I mean, he's making consecutive saves one after another. And look at this. All sorts of pressure here, Billy. Florida's going to hold of the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And a big kill keeps the one goal lead intact. We're back to even strength. Well, when you have the player advantage and you're down by a goal, you have to generate some momentum. And the first stop is putting it in the back of the net. And now they're back at even strength, trying to get back on the board. Florida's got the puck against the boards. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. The Everblades have had a lot to like about their game so far here in the first, but yet they still trail in period one. Darcy's won the draw, and they're on the attack. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. In the game of hockey, you know that your opponent is told to attack and drive the net and really get in the eyes of the tender. And for the goaltender, it's really important when there's a lot of traffic in front to make sure they have their eyes. So it's out battling, out working your opponent for those sight lines. He does an impressive job of making that save. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Darcy sliding the puck behind the net. corner now takes the feed Florida's got the puck 
And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. And he slides it quickly to Riley. That's blocked by Bickard. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Getting into the later stages of this period. Greenville's up one zip. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. The Everblades take it across the line. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Well, that's certainly not going to help the team. I mean, they're losing by one. they got to find a way to get some momentum to get on the board. Now they find themselves killing a penalty. Greenville's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. First power play opportunity for this team. It's going to start in the face-off circle, getting possession with the win, and then looking to set up. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Another face-off looming here on this power play. Face-off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. And they clear that puck. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. First period nearly in the books here. Huge stop by Zemier. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. And Denzis recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And they clear the puck from the zone. Now the PK unit has to be aware of where everyone is, whether they're in the middle of the ice, whether they're on the wall, and the angle at which they uh, take it off to glass to make sure they get it outside the blue line. Puck move back to the neutral zone. The Swamp Rabbits gain possession along the wall. do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. Be sure to attend our Auto and Light Truck Show next weekend and get a sneak peek at next year's models from the world's top automobile manufacturers. Opening face-off here in this second period is about set to go. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? Both goaltenders playing with a ton of confidence, James, and the players are going to have to figure out how to squeak one by. I think there needs to be more net front presence. They're seeing everything tonight. It's only 1-0. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Shabs the puck away. Gains the zone through the middle. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Stop that one. Sends the pass over. Mobert swooping in on the attack. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. The Everblades scoop it up along the boards. Denied by the goaltender. Bednard's going to slow it down here and hang on for the whistle. Well, a good decision right there to dictate the tempo of the game, especially when he hasn't been busy. He's engaging right now. The Everblades have had multiple scoring opportunities, but they still trail in the second. Puck scooped up by Mober. Greenville's looking to break out of their own end. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Oh, and a smart heads-up play. Mobert's lugging the puck. On the attack, they come down the right wing. Good fight for the puck along the boards. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Reaches out and uses the stick. Florida's got the puck along the boards. The Swamp Rabbits have it from their own end. Greenville's got it in their own zone. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Let's it fly!
Well, I really like the effort on this goal, James. He shows a knack for the net and being real hard and heavy on his stick as he's able to put that rebound in the net. Goaltender's got to clean that up, though. That one got kicked right back out. The Swamp Rabbits are enjoying things in twos. Here in period number two, they've gone up by two, Cheryl. There's been a lot of twos, James, and they'd love to get another couple goals to really pad the stats and increase their lead. But right now, it's about habits, not giving their opponent any life in this game. Rocked him in the open ice. The Everblades gain possession. Hornet's last save is one that's going to be remembered for a while, James. It's going to be on the highlight reel. It's on one of mine now. I mean, he stole one there. It was all but in, and that desperation and compete level, it makes the save. Oh, he stops him with the glove. Great reflexes there. The Everblades continue to trail early in the second period despite leading in the shot department. Greenville's got it in the defensive zone. Handles it along the blue line. Here he is, wrists on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Picked up along the wall by Kemp. The Swamp Rabbits pick up steam and are on the attack. Moves the puck behind the net. Works it across to Martin. And he takes the feed. Oh, he got a little sliver on it, and it stays out. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Bumped off the puck. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Taken by Coyle. He grabs the puck here at the point. And now it's grabbed by Sambra. Florida's got the puck along the wall. What a fantastic save from a high-danger scoring area, James. And, I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. The Swamp Rabbits are currently sitting in the driver's seat, leading 2-0. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Taken by Such. The Swamp Rabbits take it along the wing. Centering feed! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Florida's got it in the own zone. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. There's the whistle, and here's the call. The Swamp Rabbits will have to kill off two minutes here, charging the call. play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They haven't scored on their power play yet. They've earned this opportunity. They'll get another look at it look for different adjustments to be made. Quick shot! Oh, what a stick saving! Bedbart's opted to hang on to the puck for a face-off. Pendenza's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Came up with the save on that play. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but this team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. just disrupt the box there, and they're able to cash it in. The Everblades have come to life here in the second. Cheryl, what's your assessment now? Well, I've liked the way they've played. They've had a ton of possession. They're just sticking with the game plan, and they get rewarded with that goal. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Let's see what the officials say. Well, when you're looking for the equalizer, it's tough to take the penalty and play shorthanded, James. You gotta find a way to get to even strength so you can generate some offense. The 
Swamp Rabbits once again send out their power play unit. Greenville's won the faceoff. Quick pass to Such. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. He's right in the slot, that prime scoring area, and he corrals it on his back end. That's a great play to get it off quickly. Greenville's now up by two here in the second. They've really pushed the pace this entire game, James. It's totally. going to be a question as to whether they can really close it out. And their first few strides have been urgent. That tells me they've been prepared right from puck drop. Florida's going to start off with the puck here in the neutral zone after winning that faceoff. Sets the feet in front. Great defensive hits up play to pick it off. Such has got it in the offensive zone. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. The Swamp Rabbits have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Martin swinging the puck through center ice. Here's a short pass to Such. Puck grabbed by Riley. The Everblades move it in. Quick feed to Carpenter. Phenomenal save with the glove to knock it away. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Steps in front of the shot. And look at this, they've really ratcheted up the intensity here. And the defenders come away with it. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Here's a chance! Here's a shot! And there's a glove save on the play! Bednard's had a solid night between the pipes, James. I mean, he's done everything he could to stop the puck, as indicated by his save percentage, but his team has also been really strong. He's got the confidence of their netminder, and they've created a ton of opportunities. Expectation and the nerves when you're a rookie, and that goal is going to do nothing but give him confidence. The Everblades have jumped right back into this one here in the second with that goal. And you can certainly feel the momentum changing tides right there, James, especially after that goal. They cut the deficit within one. Here's a beat in front! Oh, he comes up with a stop! Picking up some steam at center ice. Great defensive effort with the stick. Slides it diagonally to neighbor. Dumps it into the Ozone. The Swamp Rabbits gain control of the puck. Grabs it in his own end. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Through center along the wing. Six lines, come on! Moves the puck. And there's the save. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Here in the back half of this period, the Everblades make their way back into the face-off circle, still in search of another goal. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Takes the shot. That's good by Bittar. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. The Everblades have time to work with, but they need to convert on one of these scoring chances as they are trailing here in the second. Hooked away in the offensive end. Rips it! Stops it with a glove! And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. Here in the late goings of the period, 3-2 is where we sit. It's a one-goal game in what has been a very fun contest to this point. Drives to the sweet spot. And he takes the feed. 
Greenville's crossed the line and on the attack. No room for that one to get through. Riley's gaining momentum. Florida's got the puck against the wall. Slip feed. And that carries off a body in traffic. Brings the puck to the slot. Here they come. Still on the left side on the attack. Fires it on that. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. The goaltenders are the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Florida's got possession of the puck. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. The Swamp Rabbits will play it from the defensive zone. Here's a shot, and he comes up with it. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. The Everblades have had their chances, but they still trail late in the second. Greenville's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Just wide. Florida's got the puck behind the net. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. With possession along the wall. Knocked away. And there's the save on the play. The Swamp Rabbits gain control of the puck against the wall. Martin's got it against the boards. Oh, he'll feel that one. Great reach with the puck check by Pendenza. Feeds the puck across to Sandbrook. Florida's across the blue line. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Bedard's in such great position. He's able to redirect that puck to safety right to the corner. Here's a shot. Denies him again. I love this save, James. I mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this. Buzzer, two periods down, one more to go. They always say three is the magic number. And we've got period number three next. Both teams seem fresh after that second intermission. We're ready to drop the puck on period number three. And this one's underway here in the third. Well, Pounder, we've played more than 40 minutes now in this one. How do you view things? Florida's had a strong 40 minutes of play, and they've dominated possession time, James, but they have to find a way to get up on the board and get the equalizer here. I expect them to have some urgency to activate their D and try and really look to attack off the rush. Let's have a look at that last save again. It was absolutely incredible. You're under pressure, you're under attack, really under siege, and you find a way to get to the puck. This is the stuff that champions are made of. Florida's played well tonight, but they still trail here early in this third period, despite leading in the shot department. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. We got a whistle, penalty coming up. Well, the official is right there to make the tripping call, and it's a pretty easy one as the stick gets caught up in his opponent's skates. Well, with earlier success on the power play, I think they'll operate in the same fashion, James, in that 1-3-1 setup where they look to work through the flanks because you know they've got some lethal shooters on this team. Makes a move in front! got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been one of their best players all night, a reason why they're leading here in the third, James. But it's not just about the save, it's about managing the puck and making the decisions when to hold on. Scoops up the puck off the draw. And they send it down the ice. Retrieves the puck, try to kickstart this power play. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Trying to clear... Oh, and a nice job getting the puck out of the zone. Uh, first, you got to get it. So the PK unit does a great job reading where that puck is going to be able to retrieve it. Then you got to get it down the ice, recognizing the glass. Trying to get it all alone. Stopped on that and what a save he made there. Well, I loved how he 
challenged the shooter on this, James. He didn't sit back in his net. He came right out to the top of the paint and said, if you're going to beat me, you got to find room. Still some precious time left on this power play as they get set to drop the puck. The Swamp Rabbits win the defensive zone faceoff. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. Florida's not able to capitalize on the power play, still trailing by a goal. Well, that's a missed opportunity, James. An opportunity to get the equalizer on the power play. Now down by one at even strength. They're going to have to find a way to muster up some energy. That one was deflating. To the horizon! Bednar is able to get to position and negate that dangerous slot shot. I don't think anybody was hanging onto the puck after that hit. The Everblades look to start the transition game. Looking to set up offensively. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Trying to get back on the attack now. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Along the half wall with the puck. Executive saves there and keeps his team in it. Sends it into the offensive zone. The Everblades will play it in their own end. Slides it up ahead from the right wing. Centering pass! And that goes off a stick. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. The Everblades have it against the wall. Florida's got it in their own zone. The Everblades played along the boards. Crosses the puck loose. Kemp stick handling in his own zone. Dished on over to Freeman. The Swamp Rabbits looking against the half wall. Slides the puck over. Carpenter's taking it from his own end. I'm not sure if anyone's helping him out there, but he's dialed in and doing it all himself, making consecutive saves. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Greenville's got a 3-2 lead at this point. The Swamp Rabbits win the draw on their own end. Handles the puck. Textbook poke check by Stales. Florida's got a hold of the puck now. The Everblades carry it along the wall. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Taken along the wall by Darcy. Here's a chance behind the net. And he takes the dish. Oh, and he lays out to block that, and that'll earn some respect amongst his peers. Shot! And kicks the one out of the net! And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. The Everblades have had more chances offensively, but they have not been able to convert trailing here in this third. Greenville's gonna start with the puck inside the offensive zone. And he gets in front of that. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Off the face-off, they take the puck. From the left side, they gain the zone. Fires it! Turns it aside with the glove. In front of the net, and the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. And they win the draw on their own end. Carries the puck up through center. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. The Everblades have it now. Coyle's got it in the defensive zone. Quick feed to Moberg. The Everblades get a hold of the puck. And he hangs on to the puck. The Swamp Rabbits move the puck in the defensive zone. Puck sent down the ice. We'll get an icing. Carla Bade is standing by with her answer to the head-to-head -head matchup tonight. Carla? Martin's worked hard, and even though he hasn't been rewarded for his efforts, I've still liked his game, and I think he's had the edge in our matchup tonight. Puck picked up by Martin. Gaining momentum up along the side. Oh, what a save of the play! Whoa. He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. The goaltender, they have to have talent. They
They have to have mobility. They have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Florida's Achilles heel tonight has been finding offense as they trail here in the third. They win the draw and go on the attack. Picks the puck. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Goes right to the crease. Decides to think about it. Florida's got a hold of it against the wall. Picked up along the boards by Jocelyn. Flips it up the net. Gets a glove on it to make the save. the midway mark in this period. It's a one-goal hockey game. 3-2 is where we sit. The Swamp Rabbits come up with the defensive zone draw. Greenville's got it along the wall. The Swamp Rabbits play it along the wing. The Everblades take possession in the defensive end. Florida's in on the offensive attack now. Now a quick pass to Sambro. safe spot. The Everblades' perseverance pays off as we are tied here in the back half of the third. Perseverance, you said it, just finding a way to get it done and stick with it. That's what they've done and they found themselves here. They've got the equalizer now. It's a matter of now attacking and finding a way to get on top. Takes the feed and center moves up ahead. Moves it quickly over to Kelly. and you can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. The Swamp Rabbits jump in front by a one-goal lead and a critical stage in this one, too, here, Cheryl. Well, yeah, if they want to close this game out, it's all about managing the clock and managing the puck on your stick. You want to make sure you take care of business, which means you got to own the puck and not turn it over in vulnerable spots. And now he moves it to Pendenza. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Moves it to Russell. And he takes the pass. Grabbed along the boards by Russell. Well, this game is wild, James. End-to-end -end action. Let's just forget the defense, shall we? And just go with the goal calls. Quick pass to Pendenza. Driving right to the front. And that's blocked in traffic. The Swamp Rabbits are across the line and into the offensive end. Off your stick. Florida's gained possession along the boards. Let's get the call. You have to constantly remind yourself to move your feet and get closer to the action. You wind up reaching, you take the feet out of your opponent, and you wind up with a tripping call. Florida's got a huge opportunity on this power play. A power play that can even the score here, James. It is massively important that they create some kind of momentum in their favor on this one. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Slides it across to Jocelyn. Florida's moving it along the wing. Sends a pass over. Knocked away in the offensive zone. Bednard's got the puck and he's gonna hang on for a whistle. Well, there's only one reason that this game is tight, James. It's the guy between the crease. He elects to hold on to that one. He has been dynamite. Pendenza's ready to take the draw here on this power play. The Swamp Rabbits win the draw. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. The Swamp Rabbits gain possession of the defensive zone. Puck cleared from the defensive end. 
That'll do it for the man advantage. Phenomenal penalty kill performance on that one. Timing is everything, James. A critical moment of the game. You have a power play. You know how important it is, and you don't deliver. Real frustrating for the entire group. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Greenville's looking to break out. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Handles the pass. With the stop. Florida's got the puck in the defensive end. Nearing the final 60 seconds of this one. Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Such has got it in the defensive end. Greenville's got it along the wall. Shot! And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Oh, what a hit against the boards! Executed perfectly, James. I mean, he can't maneuver. He's got nowhere to go. He's lined up, and then he's taken down. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Gets the full use of his stick for the coach. Well, the goaltender makes their way to the bench, so the extra attacker is on. It's all about urgency, being first to the puck, owning it, and look to attack at all costs. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. And off the faceoff, they take possession. the horn 60 minutes solves absolutely nothing let's go to the period where heroes are made overtime looms here on ea sports